Only on 10, a dream a decade in the making has newfound hope to one day become reality. Vanguard Landing wants to build an inclusive community for people with disabilities on Princess Anne Road in Virginia Beach. The plan has hit several snags over the years, including the company defaulting on its loan. But now, Vanguard Landing has a new partner. Only 10 on your side's Andy Fox explains how this new alliance could be a game changer, Andy. Stephanie, the new game changer is the arrival of Virginia's largest healthcare company now on the side of Vanguard Landing. Not an equity partner, but a partner in so many other ways. What was once a dream deferred could now become a dream renewed. The board uh, voted a couple years ago to set aside $40 million for us in a revolving line of credit that we have to help projects like Vanguard Landing get going. Centara Healthcare Executive Vice President Aubrey Lane cares a lot about Vanguard Landing's Executive Director, Debbie Deer, and her dream to build a community for those with intellectual and developmental disabilities. We will certainly be their partners in making sure the project comes to fruition. Lane says Centero will not own the land and will pay off Vanguard Landing's $1.4 million loan with Virginia Beach. We're willing to put our funds up uh, for this amount to make sure that this project has a chance of being successful which we do think it will. Lane says the discussions began about a month ago. His team is already in contact with Virginia Housing. They are positive. How much are they willing to give her? Uh, it's in the $30 million range. Centera wrapping arms around Vanguard Landing can send a powerful message. It tells them that there's a party that believes that uh, this project has a chance of getting done. It could be used as a model across the state. We asked Lane, to what extent is Centera financially dedicated? It, we could certainly do more depending on how the project develops, whether that is additional funding to help the edit base, or that's a grant, or whether it's additional services, or just offering support in terms of our clinical and other aspirations. Centera appears to be all in to make Vanguard Landing work. Centera Healthcare will do what, everything it can to make this project possible or if there's, this one isn't, another project of a similar uh, being. Deere's critics have always wondered whether she's qualified to undertake the management of such a construction project. One of the reasons that we decided to get involved and one of the agreements that we have with the city is we can bring and help Debbie in those areas where she may need some help. I'm not sure she does or she doesn't. Virginia Beach Vice Mayor Rosemary Wilson thinks it is a win-win for all. With Centera coming along, we, we know that it has a really good chance of success, and then we also can protect the taxpayers and get the money that it was a loan. We think this is great for the community and for the city of Virginia Beach and the developer uh, and for Centera Healthcare. The vote to confirm Virginia Beach accepting the Centera payment is set for April 18th. We are told that will happen. Calls to the attorney representing Vanguard Landing were not returned. I'm Andy Fox, 10 on your side.